There is a Bible quote that I want to talk about. Mark 10, verse 21. It says, And Jesus, looking upon him, loved him. How often, in human mind, we look upon another person and we're skeptical or we're critical. Now, we may not say anything, but we think it in mind. I ask you to rise above that spiritually, even for just this day, and have faith in the emerging spiritual self of those for whom you pray. When you see another person, instead of judging or becoming critical, say a silent prayer for them. And then from there, increase your anticipation of what they can do in life and your opinion of them and your love of them. People don't always act the way that we wish that they would. And sometimes it is a matter of great concern to us, especially when it involves family. It's difficult to see someone that we love pursuing a course of action that to our mind can only lead to an unhappy consequence. How can we translate concern and worry over a dear one into positive help. The place to begin is in our own thoughts. We can change, I wish you wouldn't, to, I know that you can, and express all that God intends you to be and to express. The highest prayer that we can make for others is a positive prayer not starting in negativity and then trying to lift it, but going first, as it can be said, to headquarters and starting from there, not from the bottom up, but from the top down. The highest prayer we can make is to behold them as they truly are in God's eyes, spiritual beings, having God's own spirit within them and have the faith in the power of God within them to lighten their understanding, to bless their way in every needed way in the moment and to guide them safely and surely to that which is for their highest good and their happiness.